What is up guys, this is Olympio, coming at you with a bit of a different discussion video today and an idea that I've kind of had. Now it might not be a unique idea because it's something that a lot of people would actually quite like. I haven't seen it been brought up in a long time and it's just something that I would think would be really nice that would tie the community closer with Konami and that is a way for people to vote on cards that they would like to see in a certain set. Now obviously this is probably going to be reprints or maybe some special cards but the easiest way and the best type of set I think this would be good for is things like Astral Pack. Now Astral Pack, Konami release all these reprints and some OCG exclusives, but they seem to be going through a lot of the very, very old card and very old vanillas. Like in Astral Pack 6, we've got, I think, three vanillas and a fusion, because the fusion is a combination of the three or two uh, vanillas. And while that's quite cool for the collectors, it doesn't actually do anything. The idea that I had was something on the basis of, on their website, they would maybe put up a list of cards and say which ones would you like to see in the actual Astral Pack. And it would just be a blanket vote of all these different cards and you'd be able to choose, say, three. Three different ones and then that would be kind of it. Now, obviously there are some very, very, very big downsides to this because as of course, there will be trolls in this. The trolls would arguably ruin it and kind of be like, well, now that this has been ruined, there's no point because although the majority of people are trying to get this working, other people were just kind of ruining it and not making it a viable solution and a viable option. However, I think if done correctly on Konami's part, it could be a really interesting thing. And I think it would really bring the community closer together with Konami because it's essentially them listening to what we want to see. Astral Pack suffers from being something that is just a reprint set and rarity bumps. So many people want Swap Frog as a super rare, and I would even love to see that, because it would look awesome, and Swap Frog is one of the most underrated cards as a common in its stature. I feel that that card should way not be a common. There are so many like that, but that is one of them. Having the three ultimate rares, and then the 10 or 12 supers, whatever it is, and then all the commons, is great. I really, really feel that this could be something quite interesting for them to do. Now, will they do it? Probably not verging on definitely not but it's still an interesting thing if they would and I feel that the whole idea of us as the player pace putting input into the actual way that they do certain things and even though Astral Pack is a very 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 small thing I think it would give a lot of people satisfaction and kind of a, just a warming tingling feeling inside that they are actually putting forward their opinion and it is being heard on some form of level. Now if we look at the logistics of trying to do something Again, if we say take the Astral Pack as the base where this would start, then we would look at maybe Konami say 50 of the most popular cards that are in this game right now and say 10 of the older popular cards that people would like to see. So that encapsulates a good amount of the current meta that have a wide popularity and then we have the older metas that people still like because they're some of their favorite decks or they still play it maybe and so on and so forth it would be just nice for that to happen then people would maybe be able to vote on however many they want i would say one vote depends on how many 10 there are so one in 10 so for example if there are 60 cards on there you can vote for six i think Doing it like that will probably work out well because there's still a fair amount of selection that you can have and it's really putting the player down to think, hmm, what do I really want out of this? I think the ultimate rares would be something that Konami would decide on themselves. Ideally, I would quite like it to be something like the top three cards that are voted for the most would be the ultimate rares, but unfortunately I don't think that will happen. For the commons, I think it should be, again, just things that people have voted on, maybe the lowest number, but I would like to see them bringing in some OCG exclusives, like they're doing now. And although the, the Vanillas and the Fusions don't have any place in our metas now, it's still nice. And I would actually still like to see that, because personally, I just quite like seeing those type of cards. I've been playing this game since the moment go, and seeing those cards that I've never seen before in our meta in English print, and I've seen them many a times in the OCG prints, it's just nice and a really nice warming nostalgic feel for it. So I want to know what you guys think of the actual concept of us putting in ideas for a set, but a set that is small, like the Astro Pack, not a set that is anything like the rotational sets 
or us choosing the TCG exclusives or the OCG imports because I feel that that is a very complicated domain and would be very, very complicated to get into. I feel if anything, having something like the Astral Packs where we choose would be the most viable and substantial option that we could possibly have. So as I said, let me know down in the comment section below what you think of the idea. If you've had the idea before, if you've played with it or toyed with it before or someone else has brought it up, feel free to comment down in the comment section below. So as I said, like, comment, subscribe, and I shall catch you guys later.